The Adventures of Robin Hood. Here we have the character Robin Hood. And what did they do? What did this character do? Well, it's a story about Robin Hood that we find he helped the poor, but he stole from the rich, which was wrong. But his caring heart for the poor was wonderful, but we don't want to steal from the rich. We want to help others. We want to help the poor. The Bible says in Proverbs chapter 17, verse 5, He who mocks the poor shows contempt, insults their maker. And the person who gloats, has a big head, and speaks bad things against those who are poor, whoever gloats over the disaster of others, will not go unpunished. Wow. We can't mock others. We can't mock the poor. That's not all right. That's not fine to make fun of someone because they're poor and to jest and to laugh about their problems. And this character did wrong by stealing from the rich, but this character, Robin Hood, cherished the poor. We as Christians, we need to cherish and love the poor. The Bible says in Ephesians chapter 4, verse 27 to 28. And do not give the devil an opportunity, a foothold. If you've been stealing, stop stealing. You must work doing something, something that's good, something that's useful with your hands that you may have something to share with others in need. You see, if we share with others, we have to work hard to earn the money, and then we can share. We don't want to steal from others or take advantage of others. That's not right. We don't want to steal from others because God's law says that stealing is not right. It's breaking His commandments. But we need to work hard, earn and then share what we have with others. That's what we need to do if we want to follow God. Work and then share with others. Ta-da! The Bible says in 2 Corinthians chapter 9, verses 10 and 11, Now God, he who supplies seed to the sower and bread for food will also supply and increase your store of seed and will enlarge the harvest of your righteousness. You will be made very rich in every way so that you can be generous on every occasion and through us, Your generosity will result in thanksgiving to God. Wow, it's so important to give. In the story of Robin Hood, we see that it was so positive that the character wanted to help the poor, but so negative that they were mean and rude and stole from the rich. But loving people is so important. Having a loving heart was so important and demonstrated in that story. God will bless you as you give and you have a giving heart. We need to know that if we trust God, He will give us what we need to share with others. Sometimes people may want more that you don't have, but if you seek the Lord and say, God, this is what I have. What do I do with what I have, what you've given me? Then God will bless you and help you be able to give and to share with others, with all people, especially the poor. So I challenge you, give. Have a giving heart. Be thankful. Show to your church the inspiration of giving. 
giving his love, be a giver. Give.